fools. Never seen the business end of a blaster, but they'll tell me how to run a war. I'm Hoth's new chief strategist. My predecessor dug us into a deep hole, fighting this war by the Senate's rules. He controlled Clabern Sector, a prime piece of real estate, for months and never capitalized on it. Now we're in danger of losing our best shot at victory. You can still fight back. Our men are fighting with all they've got, but they need help. We could win Hoth using Clabern Sector's artillery position, but my predecessor let the enemy crowd us out. We need to secure that region. And now we've got another problem. Whole squads being ripped apart by... something. Don't know what. All we find are butchered remains. There are lots of hungry beasts out there. I'm not talking about some rogue Wampa or White Fang pack. These aren't random attacks, but it's not the Imperials or White Maw either. Whatever's doing this is vicious, slaughtering us for pleasure. This enemy takes our men by surprise, tears them to pieces, and vanishes without a trace. The soldiers are terrified, but we can't retreat. Can you tell me exactly why not? Under any other circumstance, I'd order a tactical withdrawal. But if we fall back, we may as well give up. Unless someone takes out this enemy, we'll lose Clabern Sector, and then Hoth. Everything we've sacrificed will be for nothing. I promised my allies I would drive Imperial forces from this sector. I'll honor that commitment. What's good for them is even better for the Republic. Our best recon team is scouring the sector to pick up the enemy's trail. Their leader is Atal's commando. Coordinate with Captain Armoruk. Find whatever is slaughtering our people and stop it. Good luck. If we don't deal with whatever's murdering my men out there, Hoth is a lost cause. You have my sympathies. This matter bears investigation. I'll be there shortly.
this will help. I located the remains of your recon team. There was no towels among them, but I did find the combat sensor logs. <laughs> this is not what I had hoped for. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm not following. <laughs> Take care of yourself. <laughs> Should we do something dangerous? Whatever is slaughtering our people out here is recorded on these sensor logs. Captain Armoruk thought you'd want to know. Was the Micha Kulka to Maki? The Oska Hagwa Upa? What room at the border down we want to you at Oba Yakamuka? Look at the young bee, but one any bobo chopa duma. I'm sure there's nothing to be worried about. You know, he's catching on to what she goes by. Any continga. I don't want to overkill you at the bunker. Don't put on the water. And the bunker was only good by. Don't you talk, Maki Togi? With the force on my side, I'll find him. You know, he's catching on to what she goes by. He ain't got finger. What room at the water down we want to you at Oba Yakamuka? How the punyo is the water? Say grotto will be you be. Neguijin Baja, Taco Poeta, Sawata, Queen Waka, Ume Guije, Mehuketa, Jew Bahaka, Shohin Chu Chibu, Kawananu. Take to Kakawata J. Lawa Kane Hekwaba Heko Hasama Nehome. There is warmth in serenity. Close your eyes and turn your mind inward. Maja de dos ene de tene, Bayaka Kumbalaka Ugamuda. Neguijin Baja Tako Poeta Sawata, Queen Waka Ume Guije. Ni Unka was a Uba Foida, Queen Yo Yafa de Ia. I really don't see how that's going to help. Sigo maharaze kwa habu ya kaumba kwa batu kafada ya dai. Ni unka wa za uba foi da queen yo ya fade ya. Nego ejin ba ja ta ko poeta sawata queen wa ka ume goje.
will help. There were some problems, but everything's fine now. 
Listen to me, all of you. The Sith secret weapon is no machine. It's a man, a beast lord of Onderon, powerful in the dark side. Can you elaborate? The planet Onderon's beast lords dominate predators with their minds, direct their actions. But this Sith, many times more powerful, the thing that attacked our expedition dragged the survivors back to its lair. I followed, thought I could save our friends. I was wrong. The Sith Beast Lord was there, waiting, sent dozens of creatures at me. I barely escaped to send this final message. It's too late for me, Padawan, but not for you. The Sith has gathered an army of beasts to destroy our forces. Stop him. I will speak to him. Don't make my mistake. Our enemy is more animal than man. He cannot be reasoned with. I'm transmitting coordinates to the enemy's lair. Hurry. May the Force be with you.
Yes, I'm still here. Haven't gone anywhere. Sith Beast Lord is dead. His army's attacks on our people are over. How the Punyo is the water? Say Grotto will be you be. Because I'm not be chunky. Forgot that she ought to end the She bought my Udrugisa. Chobaba if Kaftu and Java. Welcome back. Words all over the comm channels of your victory against a Sith and some beast army. Just when I think I've heard it all. For a diplomat, you're certainly good at eliminating a threat. Jedi must be ready to fight when words aren't enough. Words won't solve anything on Hoth. Nobody's listening. Now that our men are safe, it's time to end this quagmire. We've wasted too many good soldiers fighting a conventional war on Hoth. The Republic has reserves of pathogenic and toxic weapons. There's no reason not to use them here, besides the Senate's squeamishness. Maybe the Senate has reason to fear using them. How do they work? The toxins and pathogens are in gaseous form. They're launched via missile and disperse on impact. Anybody caught inside the gas cloud regrets it. Once Clabern Sector is fully secured, we'll move in artillery platforms. Hit the enemy with every nasty poison and disease we've got. The best part is, our enemies won't die right away. They'll run back to their bases and share the pain with friends. General, what you're planning won't discriminate between friend and foe. Those weapons could kill innocent people, including ours. If you do that, you'll become as bad as those you fight. You sound like those blasted senators. The only difference is, I respect your opinion. If you think we can win Hoth the hard way, I'm willing to try. Maybe conventional missile payloads will be enough. Your service was exemplary. The men won't forget what you did. Neither will I. She'll feel better now. 